On a normal day, you'll catch Coach Sam Sirianni walking through the halls at Fort Myers High School. But in a few days, he'll be walking through the tunnels at Hard Rock Stadium for the Super Bowl. I'm very appreciative and humbled, and uh, they presented him to me at one of the fr uh, Friday night games, uh, kind of. Uh, uh, good secret kept. Coach Sam is a football legacy in Southwest Florida. He followed in his late dad's footsteps by coaching at Fort Myers High School, something he uh, thinks you know, caught the, the attention of the NFL. 15, 15, they kind of looked into our backstory and it kind of intrigued them the hundred years and the length of time, you know, you know, I've been here, me and my dad have been here together. And so that's how the 51st year between us. This won't be Coach Sam's first time at the Super Bowl either. This will be his third time at the big game. But he always says sitting on the sidelines as a coach has its awkward moments. Uh, as a coach, the two things that you take for granted, I never have to deal with parking issues, which obviously I will this week, and I never have to deal with what to do during halftime because you're in the middle of, uh, of inside. Halftime flies as a coach. And even though Coach Sam Steelers didn't make it to the big game, he couldn't be more excited, and he already knows which team he's rooting for. Chiefs will be my... Uh, you know, be my rooting interest, although I'll be there a bit more so just a fan and appreciate two great teams. And uh, uh, but I would like to see Sammy and uh, and uh, the Chiefs. Uh, it's been 50 years. It'd be neat if they pulled it out.